Good morning! I'm Polarized Moon and welcome back to The Witcher. Uh, The Witcher 2, Assassins of Kings. Um, how do I get through here? Do I have to just go through the buildings? Is that what I'm doing here? Okay, yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to, like, make my way around. Uh-oh. There's the bridge, let's go. But aren't we supposed to do another thing first? The bridge is gonna... Fine. Yeah, of course. And that was suave! Did you see that? He fell through there and just immediately kicked some guy. I'll find another way around. Go around. We'll meet yep. at Philippa's house. Of course! I knew I was going around. What the? Okay, so... Does this lead to that bridge? This clearly does not lead to that bridge. Uh... Oh! Hi! I did not know you guys were right here. There we go. Uh, hold on. I have a couple of things I can do, right? Whoop, the wrong one. I can do, uh, the siege... Oh, I guess, uh, I guess that is the thing that I'm doing. Okay. So I'm supposed to go... Why can I go two directions? Let me check the map here, hold on. Siege of Vergen. Oh, Yorvith is that way. Okay, so I need to go towards this one. Nope. Come on. Fine. Let me do this. Can't get away from that. And there's one guy here. Alright, so where is, uh... Where am I? Am I going this way? Is this the right way? Again, I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, there's people in a building over Is this the right house? This does not feel like the right house. Nope, there's nothing even in here that I can... Okay, well, moving on! Let's go to the next... Oh, there's a... A doy. I feel smart. It was right there, right next to me this whole time. Over here... There we go. That's where I'm going. There we go. Let's bring you guys down. That's fine. And you. Perfect. I didn't expect to see you here, Duan. Why not? A surprise visit. I hope we meet in better circumstances next time. Oh, of course. Let me fix my microphone here a little bit. Time. There is no more Saskia. No Upper Edda. It's all gone. Upper Edda. This music is really loud over their voices. Uh, well, I guess I... Guess I did that, so I guess now I have to go the other way? Cool. I, am I going all the way across the other side now? Oh, there's the bridge. Oh, okay, so I went... Okay, I got it. I did go this way, and I'm supposed to go the other way to do, like, the whole thing. I know what I'm doing. Look at me, learning how to do things correctly. I'm gonna pull out my sword just in case I- WHAT?! Why is there a golem here? Uh, sure, I'll fight this thing. <laughs> oh, I should have my other sword on. There we go. Oh, come on. Can we can we just There we go. Ow, what? Oh, you're not You're not in slow motion anymore. Nope. Nope. No, thank you. I would appreciate not that. Oh, well, I'm dead. Great. That, that, that's just great. It's a good thing I saved that, uh, that slow motion mode there for just that occasion, right? I should probably lead with that next time. 
That is a different golem than the golems we fought before. That's like a fire golem or something. I don't even know. But we're gonna do it. We're gonna kill it, and then we're gonna kill it bang. Okay, so I'm just right here. Got it. This is no big deal. So I should have my my magic sword out, my silver sword, because I'm gonna take some orins. I don't know how much I'm gonna need them, but uh, sure, why not? Wait, where am I going? Uh, oh, that's right, I was going out this way. Because there's the bridge. And I'm going to... Uh, wow, there is stuff going on all over the place. Alright, so I need to go around this way. And I'm going to save before I get up to that guy. Yeah, okay, I'm going to save here. There we go, so now when I fight him again, I'm just right here. So I need to... And then do this. And then I can make it around you. There we go. Let's just get as much of that done. Actually, I can now attack you like this. Well, the... Uh, excuse me. Ow! No, no, please. Out of... And I'm dead. That, uh... That didn't quite work out. I need to... I need to encase him in a much better circle of of slow slow motionness. Let's try that again. I, I want to kill this thing because it's probably going to give me quite a bit of experience, especially since it's so hard to kill compared to everything else. Did the did who brought that here? That's my next question. All right. Shit, you stink. Wow, it's got like a hole through it. Well, okay. Alright, you wanna... Oh, dang. So even that that is still fast even if he's inside the slow motion circle okay he's he's like dead so I need to that did not work crap 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 I'm stuck in a corner and I died I was this close did you see that oh great gonna spend tons of this out. I'm gonna probably gonna end up spending a couple episodes trying to kill this thing because why not right Alright, let's try that let's try that again. Alright, yeah, save load from the last save game. Alright, so I need to I need to shoot it once with fire, and then that way I can get the uh Okay. Shoot with fire. Exit up. Get behind you, because that does much more damage. Seriously? Could you could you not do that? There we go. Use up all that. So that'll restore. Open in the name of King Hensel. Yes, of course. There we go. What the? No! All right. So I just need to like let it charge me and then run out of the way. Yeah, charge. Do the charging thing. There we go. Yeah. That didn't work out quite as well as I wanted it to. Are you going to are you going to try to Nope. Get out of the way. Ah, come on. There we go. <laughs> Aha. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Kill him. No, thank you. 
Oh, did I get him? I got him! Cool. Uh, elemental stone... Sure, why not? I'm carrying too much weight. Elemental trophy? Okay, first off, we're gonna... All by weight. Um, and Draga Hide, I don't, I don't need those. I can just drop that. Elemental Stone, I've got a bunch of them. So I'll drop like half of them. There we go. So what is this Elemental Trophy here? And vitality plus 15 damage on bonus on signs. Yeah, sure, I'll do that. I like using signs. I'll get, I'll get a bonus from that. Alright, so I'm gonna save now that I killed that thing. I'm actually kind of surprised that I was managed to kill that thing in this one episode because I- Oh! Well, dang. That's not good. I'll see you in the Hi! Hello? Where are they? No idea. Tell me, or I'll... Don't make me laugh. You wouldn't let me out of your life anyway. A soothsayer now. Oh. Uh, kill oh. Him. Yeah, that's not gonna work for you guys. I can just shoot fire at you. Oh, oh I'm fighting the king now. Uh, I don't want to kill the king. As much as I don't like this guy, I'd rather not kill him, you know? Whoa, he's... flying around in circles. Alright. Oh. Hi! Yeah, this is not gonna work out for you. Whoops! What? Uh, whoops. There we go. Well, I guess I killed the king. Or not. You can certainly fence. It seems I've met my match. Your mouth isn't moving. You won the battle, but lost the war. The city's in my hands. <laughs> Hello. And you're in mine. For the okay. good of the Temerian crown, Vernon Roach is prepared to do anything. If needed, he becomes a murderer and requires others to do the same. Oh, Bernard dang. Lurido what? had only disdain for the world, gave it nothing but suffering. I helped Roach, joined him and his people, and I had to face another choice. Killing the commander of a forgotten trading post is not the same as killing a king. Even if both are murderers and rapists. Oh, I'm stopping him from killing the king. I see. Vernon Roach, Temerian Cockerel of the Blue Stripes. What will you do with me? You know perfectly well. You won't kill me. You wouldn't dare. I'm the King of Kedwin and soon of Lormark. The North won't survive without me. I've won. Do you know why I rushed into battle? Do you? I had to resolve it before Loch Muin. He's playing for time. Let's kill him. Wait. Tell us, King. What's going to happen in Loch Muin? A new world order. New borders. Everything will change. Oh, of course. All the kings and princes of the north will be there. Do you know the old saying? He Which who old controls saying? the Pontar Valley controls oh, yeah. the north. Have the mages been invited? It's their idea. They want to revive the council and conclave. They want to regain their rights and privileges, their place in society. What tripe. I've outsmarted them all. I'll be the one to dictate treaties. I'll show them who's ruler. You had my men killed. Of course I had them killed. What do you do with spies in Temeria? Give them awards? None of those hanged were part of the plot. Only me. You know the saying, where there's smoke, there's fire. 
Your villainy knows no bounds. What do you call villainy? The fact that I've made Ketwin stronger than ever? You fool. I'm the last ruler of the North whom Nilfgaard must respect. And it will. Witcher, reason with him. Uh... Oh, okay. Uh, okay. If we leave, I, uh, this is, this is a really hard decision, actually. You know what? We are on a mission to track down a Kingslayer. If we kill him, we become Kingslayers ourselves, and the whole point is kind of moot. So we're going to leave. Have you lost your mind? You wanted to kill a king, not a cockroach. I won't forgive him. Want to be like those murderers you chase because of this son of a bitch? Kill Henselt, and you'll aid the Kingslayer's agenda. Exactly. Let's go. That's that. That's my reasoning here. Why should we spare him? He won't rest until he finds us. Kill me, and my people will find <laughs> you. Ah! <laughs> nice. Long and hard. Let's get out of here before I change my mind. Okay then. You've got balls, Vernon. You proved it. Achievement unlocked. Reasons of state. You had a choice: kill the defenseless Henselt or battle yourself. You chose the tougher opponent and won. I may regret that to the end of my days. So, are we just leaving? We're going to Nilfgaard now, or Va uh, Lakmoin? We're going to Lakmoin, aren't we? Okay, so this was that other camp. Only we know what happened here. Well, and Hensel. The sooner we forget it, the better. I'll erase it from my memory. Sheila teleported herself to Loch Muin. Where there's Sheila, there's Letho. The murderers are gathering for their peace talks. We have to be there. Well, what is wrong with his hair? You see that? Uh-oh. Why the cut? Why the camera angle here? Oh, was it just... Sheila... Oh, another I leave in a box. I'd sensed from the start that some dark mystery lay behind that cold countenance. Following the demise of the Council and Conclave, there was no one left to keep the mages in line. But Regicide? Why? What was this all about? It seemed these questions would be answered at Loch Muin, an ancient city amidst mountains. The remnants of the civilization of the Vrans, whose dusk had come long ago. And you would be right to ask, why did you not set out for Loch Muin, Master Dandelion? Your humble servant and chronicler was forced to flee the Pontar Valley, as he very well might have paid with his life for his heroic stand against King Henselt. And to allow oneself to be humbly slaughtered, consigning to oblivion this account of incredible events, would be a grave transgression against the arts and letters. Yet forever feeling a vast shared responsibility for the fate of the North, <laughs> I dispatched to Loch Muin my faithful and capable friend, Geralt of Rivia. Have I mentioned his disdain for politics? Well, it was at Loch Muin where he could finally give vent to it. <laughs> oh, are we just here now? Chapter 3! Man, episode 61 and we're in chapter 3. Been by? How many chapters yes, are in this sir. game? And what did he say? Tamaria cannot survive. The kingdom will be divided. The nobles are riled. Constable Natalis stands on shaky ground. Hmm. <laughs> The loyal old Natalis will get kicked in the ass. How predictable. And they nearly reached an agreement, but without Foltest's daughter, it didn't work out. Perfect. Are the quarters ready? There is a uh, little problem. And that would be? Then we must look at this problem. Okay. There's no door. We can't lock her in a doorless cell. I can see that, you fool. Out of my way. Uncle Deathmold will cast a tiny spell on your little house. Versa Anem. Nilfgaard's most precious gift. <sighs> Clear up in here. This is Loch Muin, not a bloody pigsty. Oh, was that? Oh, 
Okay, so that was him just... Was he making that force field there? Marshal Rorpenek was a cruel, bloodthirsty prick, true. But the times were different. He had his men murder every last elf in Loch Muin. For years, Jorveth and his ilk have been using that banner to wipe their asses clean of the shit they do. In wartime, a commander's forced to make all kinds of decisions. It's as simple as that. Yeah, and I'm sure it lay really heavily on Rorpenek's conscience. Bollocks again. I've already admitted he was a prick. Are you defending the Enche? They've got barrels of blood on their hands as well. With the Vrans gone, we had to safeguard this source of the power. Safeguard this historic city. Huh. Elven drivel. Heaps of lizard-like... Is that snow in the background? ...found in nearby caves. All I think it is. traces and sword cuts. Uh, think what you will. I'm more interested in the city's current inhabitants. Why am I worried you're going to do something really stupid once we get there? Above all, <laughs> I'll find the cure to my suffering. His name is Death Mold. Careful you don't step in some serious shit while looking for that cure. <laughs> you feel death consuming you. You're counting wyverns before they've hatched. <laughs> He's no wyvern. He's a rat with no sewer left to hide in. Okay, there we go. And that is about all the time I've got for this episode. Uh, like and subscribe if you liked the episode. Ring that bell if you'd like to see more. Good night, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye!